Let's take a look at this Ryobi uh, power cutter. First of all, it uses these small USB lithium, they're calling them, uh, cells. You can plug in direct with the USB-C, which is kind of nice, but maybe a little annoying depending on what you've got on hand. It goes in there just fine. Real quick, I'll note that it takes two actions to turn it on, but you only have to hold the paddle trigger to keep it going, which is pretty convenient. So let's start uh, chopping up some cardboard. The technique I found is use the edge of a table or small bench or something like this. Hold it in place. Make sure you're not going to hit the table. Put it in. Push the button. And there you go. Not too bad. I would actually like to see an 18 volt version of this. I don't care if it has a giant battery hanging off the back. That's fine. But something with a common battery type I already have. I've already got the chargers and stuff. Uh, but a little more power, more amperage, and a little bit faster. Maybe half again or double the speed would be kind of nice. But uh, yeah, let's uh, hit a few more cuts. Again, right there. Button. Just one click of the button and hold the paddle. For smaller boxes, this thing is going to be absolute murder. So, we're opening clamshell packages and whatnot. I'm sure it's going to be great. So, there you go. The uh, little Ryobi um, power cutter. One last note. I was able to cut up this huge uh, pile of cardboard on one battery charge. I don't know how much is left, but I was able to do this much. That's pretty good. I'm actually pretty impressed.